everybody back with three packages. I've had a couple drinks today and I'm in a good mood. I'm going to open these up. So I got one from Ray Mitsunaga. Mitsunaga. I hope I said that right. Off a of Facebook group. And, uh, our card family thing. So, yeah. I'm going to open this up. It's one card. He had this for a Raz. And I bought it. There was somebody waiting in line before me. And he said, hey, you still want to make an offer on it? So I did. And he countered. And I countered. And we made a deal. So, Ray, appreciate it, man. Uh... For, I guess I told I thought I told people a while back. Everybody knows, so now that everybody will know, I guess. But um, I had like twelve PSA Bowman Brady's or ten, uh, I don't know, eleven of them. Another PSA ten one, some other off one. Well, at, towards November, early December last year, I had to sell them all. Even though I thought those would be the last cards I'd ever sell. Because I told everybody last summer. Hey, I would be buying Brady right now. It's just going to go up. Hall of Fame or Six Rings. You guys all know. And uh, I had to sell all that stuff for a family thing. So, I've kind of like restarted my collection in some sense. When it comes to like Hall of Fame or PSA things. And, uh, so, I have no more Brady rookies. If you guys didn't know, I thought everybody knew until... Just a little bit ago, or last week, or whatever. But so I bought this guy tried razzing it. A couple spots were taken, but I didn't want to like risk it on a raz. And so when I offered what I offered for it, um, we came to an agreement. So this is my first. Well, that's not my first, but it's my only Tom Brady rookie card right now, and it's a numbered one. So my it is my first uh, numbered Tom Brady rookie. I'm probably going to get a grade no matter what it slabs at or whatever, but number to 3,000, it's the absolute Tom Brady rookie. Uh, I thought I got a great deal on it. So, Ray, appreciate it, man. Uh, start my collection back over again. So, man, it's in the blue. Uh, I don't remember that in the pictures. So, appreciate it, man. Next, we'll go with uh, Mr. Come of an Egg. He had an auction here. Uh, I didn't get much. I think a couple things. But um, as always, dude's uh, auctions are fire. If you guys haven't, go check him and Ricky out. Man, I don't know where this is sealed at. That's how well packaged this is because I don't even know where the bubble wrap ends. So I pretty much got one big card. No, we'll show that right off the bat. But, uh, this is Kyler Murray Hollow. Uh, from Optic, and he already pointed out that one of the corners was kind of like messed up, I guess, which it still looks good to me. Uh oh, yeah, it's like the bottom corner has like the slightest little crease in it, but the front looks good. I have one of these already somewhere, I don't even know where it is, but uh, it was a good price and I bought it. I think he's gonna have a good second year in the league now that he has D Hop. Uh, can for an arm, but yeah. So I appreciate that deal. Speaking of which, Egg and Ricky, there you go. And so I bought, God, it was like this small Michael Jordan lot, maybe? I don't even know. So here's, I got this Jordan already, actually. And then, uh, this is a David Robinson card, or maybe it's a is it a David Robinson card, or is it a Michael Jordan card? But either way, Pick this one up. Uh, cheap lot. Oh, yeah, I forgot I got all those. Then on this one, uh, yeah. Michael Jordan, his eyes closed. Looks like he's shooting a free throw. Something like that. If you guys haven't watched that documentary, I, I would go watch it. It's pretty cool. I wasn't alive for uh, Jordan's heyday years, but. And then there's Deion Sanders. I just thought it was cool. Jerry Curls and, uh, and the Yankees. Even though he's a Yankee, but. Then I picked up a bunch of these Kobe. Some of these might actually be duplicates, but a couple of these were lots. Like here was this Ozzy Smith, and here's another Deion Sanders and Yankee saying Deion Sanders Ripkin. 
I can't remember half this stuff. Star stickers, Deion Sanders. Did you know I had these when I was younger? And then, uh, yeah, then here's the Kobe inserts from 2017 Panini Hoops. It's like the tribute, which is kind of crazy. I mean, that they call it tribute, but I know he had two different lots. Yeah, see, those are the same card, but that'd be a fun set to put together like nowadays. If you guys, uh, obviously you all know, but it'd be a fun set. So yeah, I thought it was a good deal for any of them. It was like, what, less than a quarter a card. But like, the, like I said, the main card I bought was this Kyler Optic, which I have one already. But And he didn't want to grade it because of uh, that crease in the corner. And this one's from Kenneth Pluff. Felf? Fluff? Uh, another Facebook group, guy. If you guys haven't checked out that group, you guys should... So uh, I've never bought from him before either. And I think my total came out to like 59 bucks. And then he's like, hey, just for buying in my sale, I'm going to knock off $9. So this is all 50 shipped. So I thought it was a great deal. So either way, you can't go wrong with Prism Rookies. Uh, there's Siako on the back. Drew Locke, obviously. Uh, Mahomes, can't go wrong with Mahomes. I don't know if there's cart. Yeah, Josh Jacobs is on the back there. Mahomes there, Bo Jackson, Future Stars, Rui, or whatever his name is, Pink, a couple of Mahomes select cards, nice, John Morant, I actually have this, Jason Tatum Silver, this exact one, but either way, Louis Dampier, I don't even know who the hell this dude is, but I bought it, I think it was like a dollar, what was it, a buck? But yeah, so, uh, I thought it was a really good fire sale, to tell you the truth. But. So this is what we got once I open this one up. It's on card at 25 from uh, Impeccable. So yeah, I bought that. Uh, Cam Reddish. Cam Reddish. I don't know how many cards are on the insides or not. A couple Tyler Heroes. Looks like there's two in there. Uh, LeBron James and Giannis. Uh, this looked like an earlier, I didn't even know what year this was, but, uh, is that a Pokemon card? Oh, okay. This is from 2008, 2009, StarQuest. LeBron there, and a Pokemon, oh, it's in a Pokemon sleeve. I've never seen those before. Tyler Hero, in a Pokemon sleeve. Another one of those, uh, RJ Barrett. There we go there. Um, what's in here? Yeah, there we go. Uh, Kevin Porter Jr. Blue with the pink. Pulsar Blue with uh, Drew Locke on the back there. Rui. And it was like me and this other guy. I can't remember his name. But, man, it's like we were like literally claiming the same cards over and over and over and over just like whoever is faster so he won some nice he won quite a few uh absolute steals but this josh allen pink prism from this year but man what card was it there was one card i thought he just i mean it was like i thought it was a steal of fire sale to the truth but mm, kind of sticky uh, and this Nikhil Ag Alexander Walker, this green RJ Barrett, which I'll go through and re sleeve all these later. Chris McCaffrey, Drew Locke on the back, KZ Prism, Isaiah Roby, Patrick Mahomes, Pink, another LeBron, Tyler Hero, LeBron, Base, Dunruss, and then Aquino and Bo Bichette, Platinum, this Juan Soto from Dunruss this year. I don't think that's game used. Player Warren, still nice. And then this uh, Warren Sapp. Let me see here. Another Drew Lock. How many Drew Locks did I get out of here? And then a Drew Lock Elite Series there. 
Warren Sapp on the back, and Christian McCaffrey, and the Christian McCaffrey purple, I think. So, I thought that was a really good deal for 50 bucks. Like, yeah, I definitely don't think I went wrong there. But. So, we'll, I'll sort through this stuff and resleeve what I need to and all that good stuff. But, I thought it was a lot of nice stuff for a really good price. So, him, uh, you guys, and then, like I said, Ray, and then obviously Egg and Ricky. Uh, appreciate these deals. So, yeah, I don't think this looks too bad. I mean, you're going to see the whiting on the corners and stuff like that, but. You don't see many of these in a 10, but a numbered Tom Brady rookie is pretty big in my book. So, yeah, that's all I got for today, guys. Uh, thanks for watching, as always. Until next time. We will see you later. Enjoy the rest of you guys' week. See ya.